this actually came in by a Patreon supporter. So okay. actually, I'm, I'm channeling it. All right. All right. Quarks. You've never had an isolated quark. No. Okay. Oh, I if remember you, this question. I know. Yes. I know, and I couldn't uh, answer it. Yes. I could. I said, well, I, I need one of the Bryans right. here. So we got one in We flesh. got one now. Okay. Excellent. Here it goes. You ready? So as you pull two quarks apart, you're actually putting energy into the system by doing so, like pulling a rubber band apart. And at the point where the quark connection breaks, there's enough energy you just put in so whole new quarks are created, so now you have two pairs of quarks. Yeah. I, I might be simplifying it, but that's the yeah, idea. Yeah, basically. We, we, we call it hadronization. Hadronization. In, in, in particle physics. Okay. Yeah. And we have models of it. Okay, so gotcha. A, so now watch. I now have a quark pair falling into a black hole. It's nearing the singularity. Tidal forces stretch it, putting energy into it. It splits, makes two pairs of quarks, and they keep falling in. Will this create a quark catastrophe? Because the tidal force will continue to split the quarks and make a new pair of quarks. Will the singularity be overridden with quarks that were created from the tidal separation and the formation of brand new quarks in the energy that was invested in it? Am I taking energy out of the black hole by making quarks with it? What's going on there? And I'd rather <laughs> think of it as a, as a not, I want to think of it as a quark catastrophe because that's way more fun. I mean, you're not, you're not taking energy out of the black hole because all this is happening inside the horizon. Uh, yeah, for a big black hole, anyway, I mean, I suppose you could say for a micro black hole. Where the separation where the is on the same is, scale yeah. Yeah. of that. But, uh, so, oh, okay, but why, why don't I just make a, a bajillion quarks as it falls towards the... Well, you, I mean, it's, it's a, I've never thought of it before. It's a beautiful picture. Yes. Because clearly you, you'll... You'll do that. You rip matter apart. That's the way it's usually said. Mm -hmm. So people just say matter, everything gets ripped apart, even yes. the protons and neutrons and even the quarks get ripped apart when you go to the singularity. But to rip um, apart a quark has consequences. Yeah, and we, we don't know what we don't know what the singularity is. I mean, other than it it looks like a moment in time. It looks like the end of time, which we've discussed before, I think, which is also uh -huh. a difficult thing to think about. So there's a finite amount of time in there for the for the quarks themselves when they're inside the. Um, Ooh, you know, that's I mean, a way, out, that's of that. way out of that. Mm, but, yeah. um, or wait, just I mean, to be I clear, wait, I, was that what Penrose said? Because as you cross the event horizon, what was previously in front of you in space is now in front of you in time. Yeah. Because Jana, we had Jana Eleven here. And she's yeah. our our resident, you know, up the street uh, cosmologist. Yeah. So. The time in front of you is finite, so yeah. it can't keep splitting quarks forever and creating. No, no, you don't have forever. I mean, even in the off the top of my head, even the big black hole, like the M eighty seven black hole, which is mm -hmm. the one we have a photograph of. Yeah, the I one that had all the, the the ones that made the news. Six right. yeah. billion solar masses, or something like that. That wow, thing. Yeah. And in there, I think you have about a day. It's about twenty four hours or so if you cross the horizon before you go to the end of time. Wow. It's roughly speaking a day, give or take a factor of two. I can't remember exactly what it is, but it's something like that. So, so That's yeah, it's freaking so, crazy. So, so, so there's a finite, there's a finite amount. <laughs> so trippy. You have a day oh left before time, before time ends. Before time ends. <laughs> yeah, and you wouldn't notice. And you wouldn't know it. No, you wouldn't notice. Oh you, my you, we we oh. could be, I mean, it's one of the fundamental properties wait, wait, of why general Why can't I notice it? Well, you wouldn't notice until the tidal forces became important. Right. Which, which is what you're referring to. Oh, then I get ripped to. apart. Right. Yeah, so, so when, you, when you cross the horizon, when you, so this room, we could be falling across the horizon in Einstein's picture, purely in Einstein's picture. We could be falling across the horizon of a supermassive black hole, would not notice. Right. So from our perspective, everything's normal. Ultimately, you'd feel the tidal forces. But As you get closer to close. this singularity. I think it's within the last few seconds for these, if I remember rightly, mm -hmm. very big black holes. And then you feel it. And then it's tidal forces, but you wouldn't have time to react, really. You just go, that's a bit. Right, but so you're not going to make an infinite number of quarks? No, uh, no, you won't make an infinite number of quarks. Because um, time stops it. Uh, right. You, I think you that's actually probably, get to the end of time. Having never thought about it, that's probably no. the answer. Wow, that, that's a really that's. So I mean, also, cool. you, I mean, energy is conserved oh as well, so you can't. <laughs> You That's, couldn't make an infinite number of right. massive things. Maybe it then, could evaporate the black hole. So you'd be increasing. You could turn the whole black hole into quarks. Well, you're it's uh, pulling energy out of the, out, 
the <laughs> well, no, the mass of the black hole will stay the same. So that process of hadronization. No, no, I get that. I get, I get that the mass will stay the same, but that mass energy budget is slowly getting converted into quarks because the quarks will keep making new quarks because you keep trying to rip them apart with your tidal forces. So you. Yo, so you're, you're saying, saying that the quartz are a drain on the so, electric so, bill. So, <laughs> like, so, you're, so you're saying that space time would unwarp <laughs> because the energy will be the, completely the converted, into, into, converted into man. It, <laughs> and and you have hole. one giant quark. <laughs> the quark I mean, catastrophe. That's, that's right. not what happens, isn't it? But, but, it's but how do you know that's not what happens? It's a brilliant question because we see black holes. Oh, Okay. Well, so that's the they, answer. They, they okay, yeah. Oh, yeah. No, okay, that's it. But, I, I can't argue with you. Know, you <laughs> so they haven't, the geometry that did is, not not unfold, is not unfolding. To yeah. them. So the, but, then but you're it, left answering why it did not happen. Right. That's what Yeah, and I, I, I think you're, I suspect the answer is because of the, the finite time the you finite have time. in there. That's so um, cool. You know, so. All right. There's well, some weed for you now. You want some? Yeah, please. It's also important to say that we don't know what the singularity is. Right. So so we really. Yeah. And we you can't know, calculate with it or anything. Yeah, because yeah, you can't get yeah. inside a black hole to see what exactly yeah. All what right. it is. Well, the theory well thank you for that. That was from an earlier it's Patreon a great, question. It's a I great thought, question. I, I, I'll know. Yeah. I'll, I'll know. I've never thought of it. <laughs> yeah, that, was, that came from one of our uh, listeners. One, one of our people. Yeah, one, of our, one of our Patreon patrons. Mm -hmm. Which, by the way, yeah. you can be one for $5 a month as the entry, just to let you know. It yeah. deserves more than it deserves the money back for that question. <laughs> <laughs> it's, a, it's a great question. <laughs> Refund. Stop the expert. You we, get we a you. month free. <laughs> that question was so great. That's funny. Yeah. Okay. Thank you.